to try to get back on defense and slaps the wrist of number one, Nate Brown, on the break. I thought he had a chance to go up there and slam it home. Dave Coleman is going to sub in for Brennan Densmore, who just had a second foul of the ball game pretty early. You don't want your seniors to get in foul trouble into this game, Riley. That's not a good look. Right. Especially so early. I mean, we're not, not even through the first quarter yet. A great start by Brendan Sullivan with two three-pointers in a row to start the ball game. Right in front of the MSU quarterback coach, Dave Warner. What a way to show out, Riley. Exactly. And that, that just makes him look really good. Brian Sullivan, number one, he's a junior forward, putting up 13 a game on a high three-point percentage of 40% on the year. He's also showing how he can really be a multi-athlete. He was really good in football season, took the team to their state title, and now he's he's helping the basketball team along as well. Yep, Sullivan, the beloved football player and quarterback leader of the Cardinals, got his team a state chip last year, first one in school history is being looked at by MSU currently. Unger to throw in. Carpenter throws it back to Unger. Davidson trying to escape the press right now. Sullivan waves off. Sullivan gets double teamed and tips it in the air. That's a good heads up play by Sullivan. And Unger just throws it away. A little too impatient there. Brown attacks the paint. Puts his shoulder into Unger and loses the ball looking for a foul there. Both teams are playing really great defensively. This is a very high intensity based game right now. Carpenter finding Michael McCarty, Sullivan in the corner. Graham Blank keeps trapping Davison. Michael McCarty gets an open look from two. That's going to be his second bucket of the game. Easy lay in from your senior. Kevin Rice is going to have Sullivan on him. Both teams playing a little bit of a zone and double teaming and trying to trap the other team here. A nice little floater goes in for a Monte Allen Johnson. And it looks like there's going to be some type of off ball foul here. We're going to have a DTV replay here. Show us a nice lay in by Michael McCarty. Gets his defender in the air and puts it off the glass for two. That's a great play by Michael McCarty. McCarty's been pretty productive for this Cardinals team. 10.7 a game on 6.3 boards, leading the team in rebounds. On the floor, Cardinal number 11, Jalen Jenkins. Okay. And like you said, the intensity here is definitely here tonight. We see both student sections just going back and forth, both teams trapping each other out. Both, both student sections are packed here. It's like both teams have a home game or something. It's pretty crazy. Off the mark on the second. Mark Miller, Sullivan fakes the pass, finds Carpenter, he finds an open Dane. He's going to have Jalen Jenkins, who gave the Cardinals a spark in the first quarter a couple of games ago, scoring eight. Sullivan for the quick trigger for three again. That's going to be off the mark. Two for three here from the three-point field from Sullivan. So that was his heat check for three in a row. And that's going to be a three. Number one for Nate Brown as he waves to the student section. That was a good corner three ball look. Sullivan trying to escape the press, crosses his man over, finds an open Jenkins. That's going to be strong off the rim. Jenkins gets the rebound. And they're going to call a foul. It looks like to be on Brown here. Foul, number 11, Mark Miller, his first. Mark Miller is going to sub in for Jacob Carlson for the Jacob Bobcats. Carlson. Dane Coleman to inbound for the Cardinals. Grand Blank takes a 13 to 10 lead here. Cardinals looking to claw at this lead. Sullivan back to Dane. Carpenter in the corner. That's in and out. Carpenter still trying to find his groove after missing a stretch of games there for a bit, for about a month there. 
And a bunch of defenders are going to be diving for the ball. They're going to call it Cardinal Ball. And a timeout on the cards. Cards got up to an early lead with those two Sullivan three balls that have been slow offensively since. 